Hello, everybody. Um, all right, welcome to my live. Um, it says it is going live, and as always, I have no idea how this software works, and I really need to learn how it's working. But um, yes, hello. Today, we are going to be um, moderating <laughs> once again on Bracelet Book. Uh, I've been doing, I, not I, I guess we, we as a moderating team have been doing a really, really comprehensive job of going through everybody's uh, patterns on Bracelet Book. And so it used to be like 2,000 up here, and now it is only 200. It is the lowly 200. Wow, which is amazing. So today, I guess I'll be going through. I'm supposed to be in class. I'm so sorry. Please don't, uh, don't, don't skip class, but I'm just gonna put this on my Instagram story real quick. If someone wants to be a, be, be a good little child or adult, I don't know the ages of people watching, if someone wants to put this on bracelet book, that would be super duper cool, because then I could get all y'all going. How are you, Alex? Hi! Um, I'm, I'm okay. Um, I was doing okay, and then I read the comment um, that m some of you oh, spilled some tea. Um, <laughs> so I was reading the comment on my 24-hour challenge, and um, <laughs> and uh, someone said, you're the Walmart version of Masha Nuts, to which I responded, oh, ho, oh, oh, ho, Walmart's, like, really awesome. I don't want to, like, bash Masha, so I didn't say, like, Walmart's cheaper or whatever, because Masha doesn't charge money either. Oh, hello there. Um, so, uh, but still Walmart's pretty awesome, and so I'm a little hurt that someone would want to comment that, but I've received, like, a lot of support, so I just kind of feel, like, really, like, 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 sorry for them, but also laughing at them, ow, because, uh, if they're so sad that they really have to comment hate on other people's posts, then I don't really want to, uh, I don't want to associate, so, anyway, hey, Sophia the pen paler, um, I'm almost done with class, yay. I never make it, yeah, I tried to do it a little earlier this time because um, I woke up today at 10 for a Zoom for college. Um, ooh, 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 the college Zooms are coming. But um, <laughs> yeah, so this right now is the equivalent of like 9 p.m. because I usually wake up around like 5. So, oh, now, okay. I, he hasn't been with me the whole day, I swear. He just heard me talking and then he just came into the room. All right, I guess you're just going to be annoying now, right? Yeah, okay, don't show your button camera, that's not, oh, okay, okay, I guess, I guess that's it. All right, what time is it for you? It is 3.18 p.m. Um, I don't know if you can see Streaky, can you see him? No, you can't, go like that, can you see him? He's like sitting right up close to the screen, oh, okay, well, anyway, I'm the girl who couldn't watch this exact tutorial because I needed to work out. Ooh, look at you working out. I finished working for today so I can watch this. Yay! Um, you might see a variation for a pattern I submitted for today. Cool. Um, I'm so sorry. <laughs> you must be very lonely. Um, <laughs> yeah, oh my god, I stand Streaky. Yes, I stand him too. No, you're so cute. Oh. Okay. <laughs> Who else is nodding? Ooh. Let me know if you're nodding right now. I was nodding earlier. Um, I don't want to move because then Streaky's gonna. Oh, Streaky got up anyway. Hello. I just did my lipstick, and uh, he's gonna. I couldn't. I couldn't decide on an aesthetic for today. I was in my pajamas, which is basically just a t-shirt, which it always is. So I chose between cottagecore lesbian, um, lesbian who knows how to do her makeup, um, alt lesbian who just puts random stuff on earrings, which I guess is all lesbians, and um, studious lesbian, um, as well as the. Um, the glasses, that's the word. Um, <laughs> so, I don't know if- give me, like, what vibes do I give up? Because I- I don't really have, like, a- like, a vibe that I give up. I don't know. Um, comment down below, like, comment, and subscribe. I love your earrings. Yeah, they're- um, I took- it was a USB cable, um, an uh, iPhone charger. Hi! It's an iPhone charger that didn't work. I got it from a garage sale for 50 cents, and I was like, oh, a charger for only 50 cents? Say less. And they did say less. What are you, what are you doing? <laughs> um, so, yeah, oh, this looks really cool. But these two colors are really similar. I'm asking to decline it, I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm a cat lady lesbian. <laughs> oh, the pattern seems unfinished. Are you sure? Oh. Um, okay, so this doesn't look like much of a stop. Okay, stop. my cat, my cat's butt's just gonna be on camera for like, okay, <laughs> how is Streaky doing? Um, 
He's he's doing okay. His birthday's tomorrow. He's gonna turn six, uh, six six years old. Yes. Oh. Um. Anyway, I'm gonna ask them to add this as a font, um, because we don't really allow. Why is why is bracelet book not working? There it is. Um. Is that my vibe is the art mom. Oh God, I'm so bad at art. Like I'm literally the worst person at art ever. Like except for making friendship bracelets. Like I can't draw. I can't draw. I'm I'm majoring in like the most STEMI thing, um, chemical engineering, and I'm minoring in another STEMI thing, which is entrepreneurship. Um, how long did it take for you to get frequent Etsy sales? Um, not until this March, actually. I mean, I was getting like really spot. No, probably December. December, I started seeing like really frequent ones. Um, so December. I started October 2018 and it started December 2019, so like a year and two months. But like with a lot of hard work, uh, you you can do it. I believe in you. <laughs> Cat plant mom lesbian. <laughs> yes. I'm going to be making a bracelet in a bit. Cool, cool. Okay, he's decided to calm down. Watch me say that and then he just jumps right back up again. I know. It's, uh, his, like, his butt's like falling off my lap, so I hope he doesn't uh, just fall. Oh, okay. I'm getting a puppy. Yay! I got my first sale today. Yay! Happy early birthday. Thank you. I'm going to go into cosmetology. Cool, cool. I always read cosmetology as cosmology the other way around, and so then I just think of people doing makeup in space, and that just does the trick for me. <laughs> Heck, can't type. Okay. Please make Streaky an Instagram account. <laughs> That's such a cute idea, but I have enough trouble, um, maintaining mine as like an Instagram account plus TikTok plus Instagram plus Patreon and plus um what's it called YouTube and live stream I, I have a lot of fun with it but I can just post pictures of streaky on my story I ordered some bubble mailers yay you're so pretty thank you <laughs> my cat doesn't even let me hold him at all he won't let me hold him unless he's like jumps up in my arms like now like he jumped uh and now now he doesn't want to can you do a live knot with me? I could. No, I can't. I don't know how to. I don't have an ext- oh, no oh boy. I don't have an external camera, um, so I don't really know how I'd go about, like, connecting that. I know Masha does, but she also has, like, a cool microphone, and I don't know if I want to do that. Um, I also can't- like, I don't tape my bracelet usually, so I usually not like this, so the- oh no. So the strings- on. Okay, so the strings are like propped up on my clipboard, which means the camera would have to be pointed like that way, and I'd have to be like zoomed in a lot. And um, yeah, I I don't know, I don't know how to connect like an external because right now I'm using my camera's webcam. So um, <laughs> yeah, um, when are you moving into college? Well, college went online this semester, and at first I was sad about that, but now I'm okay because um. <laughs> other colleges are already moving back like a university UNC which I think stands for University of North Carolina Chapel Hill um it uh oh oh hello if Kinsey V innovate or Masha happened to be moderating this parent I'm a huge fan um I'm just gonna say and thank you okay Anyway, um, yeah, so UNC Chapel Hill is already sending their kids home. They moved in, like, August 7th, which is um, <laughs> not very good. Notre Dame went back with no restrictions, and as of, like, a few days ago, um, they sent... Oh, no, 135 kids have gotten corona, I believe. Um, so, yeah, hey, I'm moderating with you. Cool! Um, how did you decide what school? I'm so conflicted as a senior. First, you have to apply, and then it's it's... It's easier to decide where to apply than it is to get in. It's not easier to apply than to decide. I'm saying it's easier to decide where to apply. Um, okay, can you please try tweaking the pattern further since the blue shading looks distorted? Um, yeah, I'm going to say the nose looks a little crooked because it's kind of screaming off a little to the left and right. Um, I, uh, me. You should make a cow print bracelet. That's on my to-dos, actually. Um, the shading on the nose still looks a bit crooked, especially uh, to the right of here. And that, it looks really nice. 
Um, if you ever want me to do, like, college Siri little thingies, um, like, I did, like, how to get an 800 on, like, the physics SAT, um, and if you, like, I don't know, because that, that video got, like, a medium amount of views, like, I don't know how many views, like, it would get or it wouldn't get, oh, that's so cute, um, oh my god, it's my pattern, actually, I did the weekly challenge, and it's added by Houseplant, too, I love that so much, actually, um, but, yeah, I did the weekly challenge on bracelet book, um, so go check it out, uh, if you want to participate, um, yeah. Alex, can you tell tips for selling on Etsy? I uh, have a video plan in the works, and I will be filming it really soon. Cherry print bracelet. I have... No, that one's not on my um, to-do list. Um, but that does sound really cute. Okay, this one should be rotated left. Can you do a day in your life without school? Um, I'm not ready for you guys to judge me because I get up at 4. And then I say I'm going to go to bed at 2, and then I really just stay in bed and watch TikToks until like 4. <laughs> and then I get up at 4 again. I sleep a lot, and it's really bad. Um, y you would not be happy with that video. <laughs> um, can you do photos, please? I, I am. Challenge. Um, challenge. I don't know which challenge this is for, but it's not a weekly challenge, so I... I don't think I can give them anything, but I'll accept it. Can mods read private messages? Nope. Unless it's, um, unless someone, like, is, like, threatening someone. Someone has to, like, take a screenshot and send it to us, um, in order for us to do anything about it, but we can't do anything by ourselves about it. Sorry. Um, or I guess that's good if you don't want people to read your private messages. <laughs> so cool being live with you. Woohoo! I live near Chapel Hill and we have 200 cases of COVID at college. Yeah, it's some colleges just kind of just like, like we do not acknowledge. Um, and so then they just sent everyone back to school. And so Hopkins was really late at deciding whether to send us back or not. Oh, this is so pretty. Um, it, they were really late. They decided August 6th, actually. And that was after a lot of upperclassmen had already signed leases on the apartment. Uh, so they were all kind of really sad about that. But for the freshmen, it was okay. And I guess like... I know, I wish they said earlier whether or not we were going back, but I know that they had to wait this late because I know they wanted to help us. They wanted to make our college experience as, as good as possible. Um, that's the exact same photo. Lovely. <laughs> Sorry. Um, okay. My school might be opening up in September. Awesome. My, uh, not elementary school. Oh god, I'm not that old. Um, my high school, um, is doing, like, a two-week schedule where you, you do, like, two, two days a week or three days a week. Like, it alternates, and then you do, like, remote learning at home. Um, but last year, they, wow, that's, like, super close up. Uh, oh god, no, just, um, okay, I'm gonna say, uh, he, um, I don't know if that's enough of the pattern to qualify, but it's, like, that's, like, 12, 2, 4, 6. 14, 16, 18, 19. I'm going to say uh, make more of the bracelet. Um, there we go. Don't see much of those. It's nighttime for me. Should I wait for the morning or create decent lighting as best as I can for my photo? What I do is I take the desk lamp that's like shining on my face. Now it's not. And I like go like this. And then I have an iPhone. And for some reason, when you use the telephoto, lens I have I have two cameras so when you use like the like the other lens it works a lot better for lighting so I basically stand up I'm not going to do it because then you just be looking at my tummy and I don't want to do that but you go like that and then you zoom into two times and then you adjust it and adjust the brightness the e color is a lot more even okay um and that seems to work pretty well and then I sort of adjust it in the photos um photo app um I just adjust exposure I put um, I, yeah, just, uh, exposure, brightness, just, I want to make it look not filtered, although sometimes I do have to color correct a little bit. OMG, hey, finally got to join your stream, yay! Um, hey Alex, I'm the person who asked if I should come out, ooh, ooh, out to my dad for my birthday, thought I would let you know I'm great, yay, that's so amazing to hear, I'm so happy for you. Um, hey, my bracelet's a little blurry, okay. I took a photo on my windowsill, but it was bright. I hope it gets accepted since it got denied for being blurry, but it was fine on my end. All right. Alex is my celebrity crush. Oh, am I a celebrity now? That's so sweet. Okay. 
<laughs> do you use Etsy ads and do they work in your opinion? Um, I do use Etsy ads. I don't know how well they work. I don't get that many orders, but I can see. I think I've gotten, I don't know how many. I don't want to check now because I don't want like all my financial info to be out there. But um, yes, they work, but they don't work. I think as in terms of getting sales, they don't work. But in terms of exposure, they do work. Um, the, the ads aren't going to guarantee sales for you. That's also highly dependent on, like, how good your listing is and stuff. Uh, so, yeah, it, it depends on a lot of things. What's your favorite bracelet of yours now? Um, I really like the Celtic rainbow I made the other day. It's hanging on my little bracelet organizer thing, which if you haven't watched the video, go check it out because it's a cool way you can learn how to organize your bracelets for super fun and super cheap. I think I spent, like, $13 on the whole thing. Um, my school hasn't said anything about their plan. Uh-oh. Oh, this is so cute. Oh my god, it's Bob Ross. Um, <laughs> can you do another bracelet collection video? I actually don't have that many bracelets. I have more than I usually do because I've been, like, stocking up in preparation and also no one's been buying them. <laughs> this is so cute. I'm gonna rotate it, though. Rotate right. What is your favorite all-time snack to eat? Oh no, I don't want to think about it because we don't have it in the house. We don't have that many like snacks in the house. <gasps> it's my pattern! Yay! That's so great. Okay, um, please do a tutorial for the Celtic wall hang. It's such a big tutorial. I don't know if I would do it because the starburst took me half an hour and that was like a quarter, no, like maybe like a third of the size. Um, my mom watched it with me and was laughing at your nervousness. Which one were you watching? Oh! Oh, the wall organizer? Yeah, it's okay. I was laughing too. I showed it to my dad and he just sort of went like, This was you? And I'm like, yeah. I don't know. But he he knows my anxiety in terms of overthinking, like, stuff. But in terms of, like, social situations, when I go with him, usually he does the talking, so he doesn't see. And I just sort of just depend on him. I just throw my bracelets in an old iced tea box. I actually used to throw my bracelets in an old uh, Bigelow tea box. We got one from Sam's Club, so it's like, it was like this big. I threw it out because I use the bracelet organizer now. But um, when I use that, I put little cardboard dividers in it, and then it was super cute and all like, like, organized. <laughs> Watching your stream with my bee that you made. Oh, thank you. Oh my god, thank you for ordering one. Um, okay. I started back at college last week. Max or Matt. <laughs> masks are required at all times outside of the dorm and everything is modified yeah our university was going to try and do that but they decided that it was spreading too quickly they were going to try testing twice a week too and i think that's still the policy because they are allowing housing for those who are not able to like live at home like if they're not like financially able to or they live in an abusive household or something like that but they're being super strict about it so i didn't even try applying because i'm not in that situation um and i don't want to take away that opportunity for those who are in that situation. Finally back, but I have to go to class soon. I don't want to interrupt from your studying. This will be here, um, right, right, uh, it, it will be on my YouTube later. What season are you in Criminal Minds? Thanks for asking. I love that show. Um, I'm on season three, episode 15 or 16. I watched um, season three, episode four a couple days ago, and the song at the end, it's called To Build a Home by the Cinematic Orchestra, and I've literally been listening to it on repeat for like ever since I watched that sh that episode which was I guess like two days ago because I've been going through them really quickly um but yeah it's an amazing episode it was like really emotional um I think the most emotional episode actually was um I think it was in season two still I think it was called Revelation it was when Matthew Gray Goobler was um <laughs> kidnapped by the the guy with dissociative identity disorder, he he had three personalities, basically, that split because his father was, like, very, um, like, very Catholic to the point where he said, like, you should oppress people because it's, like, what God wants you to do. And so the the guy who kidnapped Matthew Gray Goobler um, embodied his father's personality, and he also embodied the personality of, like, an archangel, but it wasn't really, but it was just really emotional because, like, first of all, Gooby was, like, such a good actor, and then also the guy who played, um, his name was Travis, I think, um, but it just, like, I don't cry, but I felt like I could have cried, like, if I would, like, like, if I were more sad, I would have cried, but that was the closest I've been to crying, definitely, in a while, that wasn't <laughs> therapy-related. Ooh, ooh, see a therapist, kids, it's better than crying in your room, and it's a healthy coping mechanism. Fully endorse it, 10 out of 10. Yo, I just watched that episode. 
Yeah, it's very emotional. Who's your favorite character? Gooby. Um, Spencer Reed, but he's played by Gooby, and I love Gooby as well. Have you seen Parks and Recreation? Yes, I have. I thought it was good until I watched Criminal Minds. Where do you get your earrings at? These ones I made. Most of them I make. If you have a specific question, a lot of them are on my Etsy. These ones aren't because I don't have an unlimited supply of red iPhone USB cables that don't work. I got these at a garage sale, like the cable, and then I just turned it into earrings. But like my fork and spoon earrings are on my Etsy. A um, bunch of other ones. I mean, gummy bears, but I don't really uh, wear those. Ooh, that's a high resolution photo. I like that. Um, <laughs> Excepto Patronum. Yeah, that episode was so sad and I felt bad for him. I love Matthew. Yes, he's amazing. Um, what time is it for you? It is 3.36 p.m. Okay, this is the same bracelet. So here it out. Um, does nodding affect academics negatively? I will be a freshman and I started the summer. Um, if you use proper time management, it will be okay. But if you not, instead of doing homework, or studying, then yes, it will affect. I mean, you have to prioritize what's most important to you. And for me, I prioritize academics above everything, which is why I've been making so many bracelets now instead of um, later. So basically, I'm like getting it all out of my system, and then hopefully I'll only not um, when I'm either done with studying or when I need a break. But I don't allow myself to watch TV um, if I don't not, because then it just feels like really unproductive and like when I'm watching TV when I say watching TV I mean like Netflix I don't really watch oh my god wow I got through all the photos I don't really um what was I saying I forgot what I was saying uh oh um yeah I still don't really understand what this pattern is um solar dove I can't resist nodding yeah leche um is this a logo? I don't know. This butterfly pattern is so cute. Does anyone know what number it is? I don't know. I'm sorry. I can't go back that far. Um, after university, what do you plan on doing? Well, I'm majoring as a chemical and biomolecular engineer, so there are a bunch of career opportunities available, and I honestly don't know um, what like what I'm going to be doing past that. Um, I mean, there's, like, I, I'm, I really find, like, materials um, really cool, although I also, like, sell uh, engineering, biotechnology, bioengineering, pharmaceuticals, pharmacinetics. Hello. Hi. Okay, goodbye. <laughs> um, yeah, it's, I'm gonna wait, I'm probably gonna do an internship in my first or second year, uh, at the end of my first or second year, assuming I can, like, that's a thing that I can do that, that pertains to, like, going on campus and stuff. But yeah, I'm also trying to see if I can graduate in three years so I can be on that grind and make bracelets. <laughs> no, but also so I can enter the career industry a little early and so I can tell my kids that I graduated from Johns Hopkins when I was 20, which would be really cool. But I don't know. It's possible it could be three and a half years. I have to see if I want to take classes over the summer or do research because right now I can graduate in three years except for one computer programming um, class. That I don't know if I'll be able to do or not, so I don't know. Hi. Hello. Oh, okay. Game over. D equals G. Yeah, those are those are okay, but it's fine. Can you do another streaky juice in my colors? I might have to because I've gotten some requests on that, and he's such a he's such a hefty boy. He's his birthday's tomorrow. I'm gonna feed him extra chicken. There's cat hair in my in my face. Oh wow. Okay. Hi, you're such a good boy. No, don't jump on the desk. Um, yes. Oh, oh, this is such a pretty variation. Wow. Oh my god. Hello? Hello? Hi, stop it. Stop it. Okay. My sister's going there, and literally three minutes ago, she got a notification that it's online. Oh dear. Are you, are you sure she's going to, to Johns Hopkins? Maybe she's going to some other university? <laughs> That mildly sounds like Johns Hopkins. I don't know. We got we we were told like thirteen. Yeah. Wow. I can do math. Oh my god. We were uh, told thirteen days ago that we're online. So maybe her her uh, her emails just really delayed or something. Um, all right. It looks like they fixed this. I know. I know. Um, it looks like watermelons. 
I don't, I don't know. I'm going to say it's too simple because I don't really know if there's watermelons or not. Um, all right. I'm sorry, Lally Lally, but I don't know what number the butterfly pattern was. Uh, I already said so. Please be a dear and stop spamming the chat. Thank you very much. Um, <laughs> I'm taking an Austin Community College course this year and it's such a pain. It makes me nervous for college. Yeah, I'm so nervous for learning online. Like, I think I can handle the coursework. I'm just not sure if I can handle the online part of it and just not seeing any st What are you doing? What are you doing? <sighs> so, yeah. What is this? Um, I'm going to say the green and blue look really similar. In the and the what's it called? What's it called? The preview. That's what it's called. Yeah. Some of the colors. I'm gonna say green and blue. Green and blue are really hard to distinguish in the preview. There we go. Is algebra hard? I just came into sixth grade. Algebra isn't hard, but I think two, sixth grade is a little bit too early unless you're in an accelerated program. I took algebra one in eighth grade. Um, and that was sort of like people take algebra one in like eighth or ninth grade. So I took it in eighth grade. It was okay if you have a solid foundation in like pre-algebra, but if you don't, then it's going to be really tough for you. <laughs> but uh, it also depends on how much uh, how how much you want to do well. Like if you want to do well only a little bit, then you're not going to like put in the work. But if you want to do like really well, then uh, then then you'll do well. I believe in you. Um. There's some more photos to accept. Also, Streaky's so cute. Yeah, I'll alternate because there are a lot of patterns still. Hi, how do you organize your custom orders? Well, I only accept one custom order at a time uh, to keep me sane and to make sure that I don't get overwhelmed. Um, so, that's I, I only do one at a time usually. I just wanted to say thank you for answering DMs and stuff. It makes me feel like I'm special and worth something. Aww. I mean, even if I didn't answer your, your messages, I don't want that to be the only factor that's... That goes into your self-worth. Hi, I know you're ticklish. I <laughs> hate tickle tickle, but I do try to answer all my messages, so I'm really um, happy that you feel that way. I took algebra one as a seventh grader. Dang, look at you go. <laughs> Jealous, our school didn't offer it in seventh grade. I'm bitter. I love watching you moderate. You're so thorough. I see so many patterns where pixels are off or it's uneven. It just doesn't look good. Um, yeah, people say like, you're too picky, but I also don't want to accept stuff that is bad for the site um okay looks like they didn't change this because there are no warnings but this orange and pink are i don't know if it's red or pink here it looks red but here it looks pink so i'm gonna say the so colors i'm gonna say red and orange are really hard to distinguish okay okay you want to go down you're gonna go down you're not gonna go on my desk and show your butt on camera there we go pat pat <laughs> It's really hard to distinguish in the pattern preview. Could you please try merging or changing them? Someone else just accepted my photo. I'm so sorry. I took pre-algebra last year and now eighth grade in algebra. The plastic is not a snack. Just play with the bottle cap. Okay. That Yeah, that's what we did. Our school called it Math 7-8 because they wanted to be spicy. So instead of calling it pre-algebra, they called it Math 7-8. So if you wanted to take algebra in 8th grade, you'd basically take Math 7 and 8 together into a course that's called Math 7-8. And that's where my anxiety started in terms of academics because if you didn't do well in Math 7-8, you wouldn't get into Algebra 1. And so our school has it. So if you do Algebra 1 in 8th grade, then basically your math is shifted so you can... It's shifted forward one year, so instead of Algebra 1 in ninth, it's an 8th, and then you take Geometry ninth, Algebra 2 10th, and then it's on from there, and I really wanted to take Calculus as a senior. I was thinking about this when I was 12, and <laughs> I was thinking if I didn't do well in Math 7, 8, they wouldn't put me into Algebra 1, and if I didn't get into Algebra 1, I wouldn't do well in Calculus. I wouldn't be able to go into Calculus, and then I wouldn't be able to apply to the colleges that I wanted to because I wanted to go into Biomedical Engineering, which Chemical Engineering is like really close, and I wouldn't be able to have the calculus credentials and so I would be denied from the top colleges. So that's where my anxiety started. But um, yes, and if you just take Algebra 1 in 7th grade, then that eliminates all that because that gives you an extra room, extra year of padding room. <laughs> what are you going to be moderating today? Um, mostly patterns, but if a lot of photos get accepted, then I might do photos. This one's really pretty. Oh, okay. You've already added this pattern. They're very similar. Are you sure? Are you 
you sure about? I don't see any with, with a purple twist, so they must have changed it. This one has a purple twist, but different background, so I'll accept it. Accepto Patronum. In your opinion, is pre-calc or statistics harder? I never took an actual statistics course. I took IB Math SL, standard level, because um, our school doesn't offer AP statistics. Yeah, small public school gang where they only offer uh, lots of IB and AP liberal arts, but nothing for the STEM kids, so we just have to take the same science courses check. Um, but yeah, in IB Math, there is a statistics unit, and I don't know if our teacher just taught us wrong. She was lovely, but I just couldn't understand the just statistics at all. Pre-calculus is just spicy algebra too, um, so I don't... <laughs> I don't really know what they were thinking um, when they just lumped statistics onto everything else. But in my opinion, pre-calculus is so much easier. But if you want to do something that's like applied math or st statistical analysis or accounting or anything like that, I do recommend to take statistics. I never did and I never will um, because I might or might not have planned the next three years of my college education as statistics is not on that list. How much longer will be live? Um, until my dad gets home and I become self-conscious of me talking in the house. <laughs> So probably like another 45 minutes or so. He went to the supermarket, into the bank, and just ran some errands. Hi, Charlotte. Sometimes I get so much anxiety about studying. It is bad for my mental health. Yeah, I noticed I'm talking a lot faster now because I'm uh, anxious and I don't want to be talking that fast because I want to... I've been told I talk way too fast, like in life. Like in tutorials, I try and go slowly, but I'm going to try and... Um, slow down because <laughs> if I do that and if I make myself slow down I think I'll become less anxious hey my name is Lena and I like food that's so cool you sound so sweet thank you <laughs> um streaky come back Let's see. he's he's, a, he's in a better place Ooh. oh no he's not I have to go to my class meeting started bye thanks for coming where's the cat he's in a better place I'm sorry he'll probably come back later when he gets lonely and realizes that I'm not gonna follow him <laughs> You've got me into nodding and I nod regularly now. Thank you. That's so nice. Wow. Okay. Someone really just said copy-paste. Okay, this one's really pretty, but I definitely feel like... Okay, someone's commenting on all my videos on TikTok. Okay. If they're different people. I guess I'm just that popular. Cool. Hey, please say hi because this is my first live I catch and I'm happy. Hello! I'm glad you could make it. So this one, I'm just going to call this a sunset. It has two purples and three warm colors. So I'm looking for two purples, three warm colors, and a white. Two purples. This is kind of it, but it's more blue than purple. And it has a different background anyway. Two purple. This is going to take forever. Oh my god. We have to stop. We have to... Okay, this is kind of, but it's... Um... We just have to stop accepting these at some point. Okay. Yeah, I'm just gonna- okay, I saw one. I saw one before I scrolled all the way down, so it's too similar. Sorry, love. Well, wow, you guys have really worked through those patterns. I'm happy to see the pattern notification number under 300. Yeah! Um, a couple nights ago, I moderated for two hours, and my Wi-Fi was terrible, so I actually didn't get through that much anyway. But, um, still, I felt, I, I, I took away, net, I took away, like, 75, because people were submitting stuff as I was moderating, but also other moderators were there with me, so, like, in total, we reached, like, we, like, decreased by 75, so, when, like, like, 10 of us got together all at the same time, and then we got it done. What is your Etsy shop called? It's called Alex Innovations. I'll put the link in the chat. Like, comment, and subscribe. I guess if you want, www, no, not four W's, three W's. Um, because I know how to type. Go check it out. Um, you get 10, no. 10? No. You get free shipping. Where does 10 go into that? You get free shipping if you spend over $35 in the United States. And if you use a special code, Insta, you can get 10% off your order of $15 or more. So, yeah. Is it possible to do triangle ends with more than one color on an alpha? If you mean single triangle ends, Probably, yes, because I do that on my recycled rag rug. If you mean double triangle ends, then you can use as many colors as you want because they're the base strings. Um, what's it called? Oh yeah, I made a tutorial for it, and it's coming out tomorrow. Um, what is your favorite pattern, and how do you suggest getting through bracelets faster? I suggest, uh, my favorite pattern changes all the time, but um, right now I think it's the, the Celtic wall hanging that I made that's on my Etsy. Um, in terms of nodding faster, I basically just put on a really, really compelling um, TV show, like Criminal Minds, and uh, then I just nod until I finish the show, I finish this episode, 
or if I'm halfway done through the episode, but done, or I mean halfway done with the bracelet, no, yeah, halfway done with the bracelet and all the way done with the episode, and the episode's like a, like a cliffhanger, um, then I'll just keep nodding until it's done. <laughs> that was a really long answer to your question. Um, I submitted a variation and I said, you have submitted too many variations for your rank. Yeah, we're putting a limit on variations because people are just submitting variations instead of actually making patterns. They're just, and it, they're not like good variations. It's like they just make everything the same color or they just, they just submit the exact same pattern. Um, so it, it's kind of a waste of our time and it's a waste of your time because you won't know. So we've put a limit for all the ranks so you can't um, submit too many variations in one day. This is cute. I like it. Let's put winter. Let's just put that into the search bar and see if there's anything like it. Um, oh, this blue one looks so cute. Do you have a tutorial for triangle ends? Yes, I have one for double triangle ends like this for normal patterns, and I'm coming out with a really big heckin' long video tomorrow. It's an hour and eight minutes, and it will show you like six different ways to make triangle ends, as well as a bunch of other things. Okay, these are just putting me in like a Christmas mood, which is funny because I'm Jewish, but just the aesthetic of Christmas, not the religion, but just the aesthetic is just so endearing to me. Just makes me feel all safe and warm, cozy. Um, have you seen Breaking Bad? Yes, and I love it. Hey, beast of all, uh, I went outside in a rainstorm. Now I'm soaked. It's nice and sunny over here. I don't know, I don't know where you live, but it's nice and sunny over here. What's your username on bracelet book? It's Innovate. I play pixel coloring games and I've seen pattern from, patterns from the game on bracelet book. Most alphas are copy of pixel arts. Um, if you have anything specific, you can message me on Instagram and I can see what I can do about it. Um, but I can't really do anything from that statement alone. Sorry. Um, I accidentally submitted a variation that was just the same color and I still feel a cheap shame for it. It's okay. It's all good. Um, that We just put a cap on how many you can submit just to make sure that uh, no one like just does that repeatedly. But if you did it once, it's okay. Netflix or YouTube? It alternates. Netflix is great for Criminal Minds and other shows, and YouTube is great for supplementals, like cast interviews or table reads or stuff like that, um, which I really like as well. This is pretty cool. DNA, baby. XOXO, baby. I'm on season three of Breaking Bad, and I'm very worried for Hank's health and safety. I'd ask a question, but I don't know when it happens. Yes, you have you have reason to be concerned for Hank's health and safety. That's all I'll give you. I don't want to spoil anything for you. Have you seen Stranger Things? I've watched all the seasons. Yes, I think I've watched all the seasons unless they came out with a fourth one. Um. Yeah. Um. I don't. I mean. The, the O's are a little distorted. All the letters are a little bit distorted. It's a little bit simple. Um, the letters are a bit distorted. And the rest of the pattern doesn't meet the complexity, heck, complexity requirement for our website. Oh, also, if you guys like my bandana and want to support a small business, my lovely friend, her name is Casey, she has a, a website, well no, it's her Instagram is called Casey Laurel Boutique, just Casey Laurel, L-A-U-R-E-L, -E Boutique, I will put it in the chat, um, where I got my bandana, it's, it's, it's not like a tie bandana, like it has an elastic in the back so it doesn't poke out in, in your head and it's really nice, um, Casey Laurel Boutique. She actually goes to my school and she's super nice. I love her so much. Um, remind me of Robin from Stranger Things. I wish I was Robin from Stranger Things. I like, I just like wanted to be her. Like, I don't know. She's very nice. Yo, my name's Casey too. What if you actually run the boutique? And it's just, it's just a lie. Just Casey. Did you watch Orange is the New Black? No, but one of the main characters. I don't know her name, but she's short, she has black hair, and she's the lesbian. That's all I know. But she, um, her, uh, the actress, I mean not the character, the actress came to our town. And she did a, I think it's, it's Mary, Mary Effin Christmas was her show. 
and she like visibly cursed, which was so funny because I work at a I used to work at a performing arts center um, for our local college. Um, <laughs> And before everything got closed down and she came and it was just the funniest thing because there's like usually like classical music conservatory symphony orchestras and it's just like two hours of just people on the violin like a whole string orchestra and it's all like Whoa! And, and like like 95 percent of the audience like is over the age of 80 and then this time it was like all millennials and they were all screaming like have a merry effing christmas and like and like with her band and like the lights were like 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 a like a show it was just the funniest thing and i wasn't in the theater because I really don't like loud noises, ironically, for working in a performing arts. It, it, it's it's like a concert hall. It's it's not like a play. There are, there are plays, but it's like college students. Anyway, um, it was just so funny, and um, I, I I knew that she was like famous, but like I didn't like know the significance. Like if it was like Walter White, I would have been like fangirling. But I also don't like Walter White. I like the character. I mean, I like the actor, but in seasons four and five, he goes a little bit downhill. Sorry for someone who said that they're only on season three, but that's not me. Yeah. Um, okay. Did, why is it? Okay, bracelet books just said see ya. Um, yeah, I'm getting a lot of comments and I know I am, but I gotta fix this. Okay. Do you have any thread preferences? Yes, I do. If you check out uh, my video supplies I use and recommend, I'll show you all the bracelets. I mean, all the strings. No, yes. All the. <laughs> Start over. If you check out my video supplies I use and recommend on my YouTube channel, you can see all of the supplies that I use and the supplies that I recommend. Wow. What a, what a name for that, uh, for that video. <laughs> Brian Cranston. Yes, he's amazing. I love him so much. Um, Okay, this is a little, well, you can't really see the yellow, so, um, okay, some of the colors are really hard to distinguish in the pattern preview, and I'll say the yellow and the pink blend together a bit. Alright. Um, any update on your collab with DMC? I don't know. I emailed them asking for a tracking number yesterday, and they haven't gotten back to me yet, but I'll, I'll let you know when I know. <laughs> but <laughs> thanks for checking in. I'm waiting on DMC's email back. I don't want them to copyright it. Hi, Grace. Do you have a sister? Yes, I do. She's 16. What up? I'm Alex. And um, no. What up? I have a sister. She's 16, and she never wants to be on my YouTube channel. I'm just kidding. She does. No, she doesn't. I filmed a video with her and I spent four hours on it and then she got self-conscious, which is totally understandable, but I wish she told me earlier before I spent four hours editing. Um, no, that's not right. Why did I select that? I'm gonna say the colors are a little, a little, a wee bit hard to distinguish. This one is a little, a little simple. Um, I'm gonna write that down, actually, because it's a little too simple for our uh, pattern love. Uh, four, eight, Two six five two seven four three. Oh, but the variation's okay, so I'll leave it. <laughs> I'm currently numbering pages in a notebook for school. So organized, many many studious. Um, oh, that's so cute. Oh, but the colors are too simple, similar. My bad. Hi, Sophia. Wish I had a sister. Yeah. Sometimes they're nice. Sometimes they're not. You keep missing my messages. I'm sorry. I have a lot coming in, but I'm trying to read as much as I can. Um, okay. Oh, it's egg in a frying pan skillet. Um, could you please try adding a color? Okay, they did that. I like it. I don't know what they're talking about. I hope that it's an even number. What? It's, um, 30, okay, so 33, 51 minus 32, that's like 19, and then we have 18 here, so... Unless I did the math correctly, there's one, okay, I'm just going to count because I don't trust myself. So there's 18 here, and then we have 3, 6, 9, 12, 15, 18, 19. I was right, okay. Um, could you please make the top and the bottom the same number of pixels? The top is 18 and the bottom is 19. That was some fast math. I don't know, I'm pretty proud of that. It's Dory. Um, it's baby Dory. Yeah, I think that's okay. Can you maybe do a cat or dog bracelet collar DIY? Oh, I don't have the supplies for that and Streaky 
hates wearing collars. Did you watch V a V, aka my gay awakening? Your how about your gay awakening? Gaykening? No, I haven't. <laughs> I haven't heard of that actually. Sorry. Hi Chloe. Do you have any tips on starting an Etsy shop? Um, yeah, have, you should have really good photos with a clean white background. The item that you're selling should have, uh, yeah, good lighting on it, and you should have a really descriptive description. <laughs> I'm gonna make a video on how to do that when I, um, when I find a time to do that and feel confident and not like a potato to actually film, because I haven't filmed for like a month. <laughs> um, <laughs> yes, but I will be making a tutorial for that. <laughs> Can you do the 24 hour challenge again? Am I gonna get more Walmart comments? Just kidding. Um, because I know you guys would never do that because you're actually taking the time to watch. Um, no I'm not because it gave me a severe headache that lasted multiple days and it was really, really bad for my physical health. Like, my knees were aching for like a whole day and a half. Um, <laughs> and so it was really bad. Um, but I'm not enough. I'm probably not enough in three days to make 24 hours, so that's like eight hours a day, which is like, understandable. Favorite Netflix show at the moment? Criminal Minds. What is this? CSUN, Northridge, Matador, Cal State, CSUN. I'm gonna look, I'm gonna Google that. CSUN College. I gave my cat a collar once and he almost died. Oh no. That's not good. California State University. All right, let's look at the images. Look at logo, logo. All right, so we're looking for something with stars. Stars? I don't see anything with stars. So I'm gonna ask, I'm just gonna say the simple text pattern's not allowed, so sorry love. Hi, it's just Elizabeth18, thanks for subscribing. New subscriber! What's your favorite color? It's blue. I cried when Netflix added HP in Europe. Harry Potter? Did they add Harry Potter? Or is it like HP Lovecraft? I'm glad that you're showing this process and it helps to understand the moderator side. Yeah, it it's it varies a little bit from moderator to moderator, but this is sort of the general thought process. I, I can't speak for all moderators. Um, but yeah, this is what goes through my head, sort of. And also just the incessant rambling of like, hmm, let's be anxious about something for no reason. Hi, you just said hi, hello. Someone should take a tuner and... Wait a second, what did I just declare? Oh. Me. Me. Um, yeah, I declined that and then I did something something like this. Yeah. Also someone I was gonna say someone should take a tuner and see how how high and how low my voice goes because it's been going really low because I feel it like starting to get sore because I'm just like haven't talked this much in a row in a, like a really long time. I love you so much. Thank you, Amber so nuts. Dude, where do you live? I live in New York, and I heard, I read on Kinsey B's, or I heard on Kinsey B's story, it's fire everywhere. Yeah, she's got kicked out of her house, actually. I don't know much about that. Um, I don't know what it is. It says it's a video game, but that's really not clear, sorry. Um, if I were to order a custom order, could you say a blue gradient? Yes, you could. Um, the color numbers there, like no one ever uses the color numbers. They usually just say do this pattern and use these colors or use the patterns in the color, use the colors in the pattern. It really doesn't matter. Um, but yeah, but if I'd, I'd recommend messaging me on Instagram first because people also put in the wrong um, number of strings or, or type of pattern and then I usually have to decline it because I don't want you to overpay, but I also don't want to get underpaid. <laughs> so. Yeah, but just message me beforehand. Chances are you're right, but I just want to make sure that you're right. Savage! Yeah. I have to go. It's okay. Thank you for coming. We had a lot of fun. Okay. Um. Aw, the kitty. Yeah. Do you see inappropriate things on what happens to that account? I don't really spend that much time on like the forums of bracelet books, so I don't see it firsthand, but users do report to me and then I can investigate. And then I can't re remove it unless it's in the chat. I can remove stuff in the chat. Don't go spamming the chat because I'm not checking the chat. Don't do it. Um, but I can't remove patterns and stuff unless they're like they haven't been like accepted yet. I can remove comments, which is like over here. Uh, but I can't remove like 
like I can't ban someone, I can't remove a pattern, I can't remove a variation, that all has to go to the admin. Um, Alright, yeah, they're not. But spam, spam, this is called spam. It's also kind of meat, but it's called spam because this pattern has been already declined. What? This pattern has already been declined a few times for the same reason. And they have not changed it because it doesn't look like they changed it at all. And this has been the third time that it's been declined, so I'm just removing it because that tells us that you don't intend on changing it and it doesn't do us any good to just keep de declining it and then you just keep accepting it. So, yes, love. Um, oh, looks like there's a required event that I have to go to that I'm not going to go to. It says, Academic Freedom! I don't care. <laughs> I don't really care. Do you have a TikTok? Yes, I do. It's alex.innovations. And I post lots of cool stuff there. And ironically, I posted the video of me saying, you want to hurt my feelings? Um, I'm always put second under Masha. And then I read the comment of someone saying, you're literally the Walmart version of Masha. And I'm just like, oh. <laughs> like, I don't know. Be a nice person on the internet. Just like, I have feelings too. I don't want to use my age as a defense because I literally turn 18 in like 12 days or so. 13 days? I don't know. Like two weeks. And I'm, I'm, I'm still a kid. Like, I still live at my parents' house. I'm going to college, but I, not yet. I still have a couple days before I start college. So I just, just pay attention. I have feelings too, honey. I recovered from depression. You don't think your comment's not going to make me go back into it. What are you trying to accomplish here? I don't know. Um, that, I can't accept that. I'm not allowed to have any social media. I asked about the blue gradient. Um, message me on Etsy then. I think you can message as a guest. Um, you go on Etsy. My Etsy is Alex Innovations. You could just, it's like Alex Innovations, stuff like that. Um, and you can just message me. You can just say message, message seller and just say like, Hey, I was on your live, and like, I want to ask about it. Masha Knotts, I love her. Yes, I love her too. Um, you are the equivalent of Masha. Both of you are so cool. Yes, I want to say that. I don't want to put her down. I don't want to say I'm better than her. I want to say that we're equal, and I shouldn't be lumped in with like her, and she shouldn't be like lumped in with me or something. I don't. I've never seen any comments saying that I'm better than her, but I definitely have seen comments saying that she's better than me. So I don't know. It's like, it's like feminine, it's like a feminist issue. I don't want to be better than men. I just want to be treated the same as men, you know? Okay. I think Masha Knotts go, goes by Raccoon on here. Yes, she goes by Raccoon on a bracelet book, but I'm sort of referring to as her name, <laughs> which is Masha. It's actually Maria, but we all call her Masha. And so I think she vibes with that and I vibe with that. So it's all good. How dare they say you're in fear. Thank you. My little sister made this. Okay. Um... Haha, <laughs> derpy, derpy, derpy poison thought. Um, this is so cute, but it's a little too simple for our website right now. Sorry. Can I make a tutorial on how to make earrings? I did actually. It's called a How I Make Earrings. Or how to make ear how to make stuff on ear I don't it's like how how to how I make earrings it's it's on my it's on my web uh, on my um, YouTube if you just google like how to make earrings Alex innovations or something it should pop up ooh overwatch ooh similar colors ooh spicy do a collab with Masha Knotts. you know what I actually did two collabs with her already and you should definitely watch those because I loved editing those no I hated editing those but I loved filming them I hated editing because they basically just broke my computer uh because there was so much like there was like 32 gigabytes in files which is like a like a large heck and much my computer's hard drive is like 120 gigabytes so that's more than a quarter basically um wee! I'm making a I do not care bracelet that's cool I do care even though you Donut. Haha. <laughs> <laughs> um, I tried to find the comment and I couldn't find it. I was finna go off. Oh my god, is it not there? Did they delete it? It should be okay. If you're talking about the 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 Walmart comment, as it will, as it will be known. Um. Oh. <laughs> I'm sorry, Alex. I shouldn't have said that. Your channel is really good. 
I'm sorry. Yeah, well, too late. It's already a meme. <laughs> it's at the end of my 24-hour challenge video. You can find it if you want. Um, it's it's on the public, so I can't control what we do. Not not yet. <laughs> um, how long will you be on the live for? I want to be as long. I want you to be on for as long as you can. Yeah. Um, my dad went out to get some to run some errands. But he might be back now. I don't know. If he, like, comes into my room, I'll tell him to go away. But he's doing his own thing. He's busy. He's keeping himself busy. So, um, probably, I don't know. I don't want to give a time limit because last time I said, like, I'll be on for half an hour. And then my Wi-Fi just said, nope. So, um, I, I don't really know. But I'll give you, like, a heads up. <gasps> it's streaky. Oh, it's not streaky. Um, it's kind of streaky, but not really. Um, okay, but I'm gonna, that's a little... It's it's great streaky. It's great streaky. Yay! Okay, just so they know it's me. Um, and then next moderator is just gonna be like, like, move the mouth like up towards the eye, like yeah, yeah, you know. Um, I got just got more string about it. Oh, heck, I just got more string, and I'm so excited about a pattern recommendation. Um, I personally like pattern two eight zero zero nine on bracelet book. Did I make it? Yes. Is that why? I'm recommending it partially. Also, you want to see, someone sent me something amazing for my birthday, and I really want to show you. But I'm wearing my pajamas, so just just, just forget about it. Um, so someone sent me all this string, and like, like you're like, wow, that's a lot of string. And they, they, they sent me more. They sent me two gallon freezer bags of string, and... And unboxing, oh my god, they sent me scrap string as well, and they sent me more scrap string, and, and this person, they, they sent me a, they sent me a birthday card, I don't expect anyone to send me these things, and, but they did, and I'm just so blown away, cause, just, wow, and there's multicolor, there's rainbow, there's foil, there's regular, there's black and white and all sorts of colors and just wow like that's wow okay hi echo but i just wanted to share that because i'm super grateful to them and i was thinking about making a video about like opening stuff for my birthday but i i feel like that video would just be like me feeling like really entitled to stuff which i don't feel entitled to just because i have subscribers doesn't mean you guys should send me stuff because that's just not how it works and also i don't have a post office box which means that giving my address out to random people on the internet would just be kind of creepy. It's time for crab! Um, so, yeah, but anyway, I was really grateful to them. Holy wow, that's a lot of string. Do you play Animal Crossing? No, I don't. I don't have a Nintendo Switch or whatever. Sorry, love. This is such a cool pattern, though. I have a video idea. You should type a random number into the pattern searcher on Bracelet and then make that pattern. That's an interesting idea, but... I don't know if that would be a very entertaining video <laughs> because it's just me just typing something and then just making the bracelet. I love that you don't swear. I used to not, but all my friends do. Yeah, I I don't. My friends did, but I also didn't have that many friends who were really close. Um, one friend did, but she only did it when she was mad. Okay, so you came in one door. I know, and now you're gonna you're gonna beg to go out the closed door. There's an open door right there. I'm just gonna stand there looking cute. Okay. Well, <laughs> OMG, I bet she won't see this. OMG, you lost that bet. Haha. <laughs> Haha. Uh -huh. Okay. Um. Yeah, there are a lot of variations for this. Um. Mm. I'm just gonna say this pattern has too many variations. This pattern already has no too many variations. Sorry. Okay. Streaky. I know. Come here. Come here. Come on. Come on. I don't want to get up. Come on. I know. Oh. Hello. It's streaky. Ho 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 ho. My computer's about to die. Do you have a charger? Thank you for reading and reading my comments and responding. I'm gonna go. Bye. Thanks for coming. Hello. Play sponsor, Strictors. Do <laughs> her side profile. Oh. 
I have been self-conscious of that because I have a I have a a lovely shaped nose because I've been wearing glasses since I was six and now it's a little wobbly down here but I've never been able to actually look at my profile on the side but thank you very much um, I thought you can't add any more variations to the candy stripe pattern yep that's why I declined it saying that there were too many variations um, all right, um, I hope you get to mod a pic I just sent in. Oh, I'll check it out. It's a little bare one. It probably will be towards the end, so I'll get through all these first. These are so cute. Okay, but, um, can you give any advice for a bracelet content YouTuber? I'd recommend to get a clear shot on your photo, on your, like, like, make sure the bracelet isn't blurry and so you can clearly see the string. Sometimes I film too much because I want the bracelet to be centered, but the bracelet shouldn't be centered. It actually should be towards more of the top of the shot, so you can see the, the strings underneath, if that makes sense. Um, that's such a cute pattern. I, I think it's... I think it's... Yeah. <laughs> I'm making a cat alpha with a blue and purple multicolored string. I actually did that. I did. I made a little cat, and I made purple, blue, and pink string um, with from DMZ, and it was super cool. I'm trying to open my tea right now, but I can't open it. Like an iced tea or like a tea packet? I'm sorry, I can't help you with that. Um, I was in New York a week ago and it made me think of you. Aw. I don't live in New York City, though. I live in the not cool part of New York, upstate, which is where it's very redneck, very homophobic, very racist, and too many cows and not enough people. Okay, it's not loading. Um, hello? Anybody? Oh, okay, it did load. It says challenge, but there's no weekly challenge, so I can't. I'm sorry. I mean, the first outfit today to turn out amazing. Yay! Um, do moderators get paid? No, we don't. It is on a strictly volunteer basis. Okay, this one's a little blurry, so I'm gonna say I'm too blurry. <laughs> okay. I live on Long Island, baby. I don't live on Long Island. I live live on the Big Island, aka North America. I lived in some parts of upstate New York for the first few years of my life. Do you remember how racist it was? Maybe it's an it, maybe it's a new development. I don't know. With the political state of our country, I I firmly believe if we were all united, we could revolt against the government. But I was having a really like I was having a debate with with this kid from from my college. He's a year above me. And he's like, he goes to the music conservatory. So he's like a liberal arts kid. And I'm like a STEM kid who never took a government class and who took a, a terrible five-month economics class offered by our school that half the kids were falling asleep in and the teacher was an angry man. He was just an angry short man who wore a different tie every week. Um, but if you see this, I enjoyed your class. <laughs> Look, I'm running a bracelet business. That's, that's, more, that's more than anyone else could have. But anyway, why is this not loading? I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to go back to Pat. Pat oh, okay. Um, okay, but anyway, I was having a good debate with him, and I felt super cool, because I was just like, yo, uh, I can talk about this. Will you be able to vote in the next presidential election? Yes, because I turn 18 in September, and um, the election's in November, which means I have a solid two months to settle into being an adult and stuff, so you think I can be an adult? Me neither. <laughs> I'm lost trying to make this bracelet. Oh no! Maybe you could take a break, and then after this live, you can skedaddle on over to my Starburst tutorial if you're using the same number of strings, and you can uh, maybe uh, reference that and support me with ad revenue and help me pay $77,000 a year to go to Johns Hopkins University. <laughs> okay, what is a good pet bracelet pattern on a bracelet book? I really like 28009. I live in Czechia. Czechia? Czech? Czech? Check one of your international subscribers. Hello, welcome. Um, yeah, I accidentally submitted a photo. Could you decline mine? Um, what? What's your username? I, I don't know what your username is. I'm sorry. I'm turn 18 in May, so I can't vote. I'm so sorry. Did you say two? No, I said two eight zero zero nine. You're so pretty. Thank you. Uh, this is my first stream. Hello and welcome. I don't know why photos aren't loading. I'm sorry. I'll I'll try and do that. It's they they load when I'm like gonna go back. Like, ooh, gonna go, gonna go, gonna go. No. Okay. I'll go back later. I'm sorry. Um, currently playing Animal Crossing and watching your stream. Wow, such multitasking. Um. 
Okay, this is a simple text pattern as well. So, sorry, love. Notice me. Hello, you are noticed. How do you handle your Etsy listings? I have so many things I want to try, but I don't have enough time. I also want to build up an inventory so I don't get stressed. Switch it up. Make different bracelets. Um, I can make like two rag rugs before I just become insanely bored and have to stop. But um, just switch it up. Make a few. Take a rest. Make a few. It should be fun um, unless that's your only source of revenue and you're living alone and have expenses to pay as an adult, in which case um, you should find another source of revenue because bracelets, making bracelets, although very fun, is not a... Uh, a very efficient means of making a living <laughs> because you if you paid yourself as much as you'd make during a wage paying job you wouldn't make enough you, you, no one would buy it basically um i mean I, I'll, I'll spend six hours on a bracelet and if i were to charge sixty dollars ten dollars an hour minimum wage no one would buy it and you're not gonna pay sixty dollars for a starburst so it's fine it is what it is so when is your hour-long video coming out it's coming out tomorrow at 2 15 eastern time there's a countdown on my instagram story if you want to check it out are you done with photos? No, um, they weren't loading earlier, so um, I can go back and try, but they really weren't loading, uh, and it was just taking too long, so sorry. Um, did your $100 wall hanging ever sell? Well, I'm not not yet, because I only listed it a month ago, um, and sometimes bracelets take longer than a month. I've had bracelets on there for a couple, couple months in there, but... Uh, yeah, basically photos aren't loading, but I'm waiting because I think someone's going to come along and see that it's a worthy piece of art that they would spend that much money on. Um, so I'm just waiting. Be patient. Patience is of the essence. Hey, hey. Uh, ho, ho. Don't put in random emojis wherever I go. Um, how did you become a moderator? There was a forum. How did I is different than how you would go about becoming a moderator. Um... But there was a forum a couple weeks ago that the admin just asked anyone who was over 17 who wanted to be a moderator to just say they wanted to be a moderator and, like, what they wanted to do, like, how they'd be a moderator. And then we, uh, as current moderators, took a vote on that. About how many inches do you make your bracelets? I make mine usually 5 to 6 inches, usually, and then I make ties around 5 to 6 inches long. So I want to, I just have so many, so many. Super duper cool. Um, wait, wait. We already have a lot of space and moon patterns in our database. Sorry. Okay. Hi, Alex. Hello, Joanna. Um, okay, so we have this by Pride. We love to see it, um, but there are a lot of stripe patterns already on the database that you could apply these colors Heck. to love we love to see that pride though yeah i just messed up on my bracelet and i'm so annoyed Ooh, when you mess up okay, so my dad's a dentist so I've, I've always had this dental influence but there's this tool i got it for like two dollars on ebay um I, it was a pack of two, I think. I got it super cheap. Um, it's called a Dental Explorer, and it has one end that's sort of curved. I actually heated it up and might have bent it, but the other one's okay. Um, and the other end is sort of a bent like that, but they're very sharp, so be careful with them. They're not needle sharp, but they're close to the needle. They, they, it hurts right now. Um, but you can, it has a nice long grip, so it, it allows you basically to not, like, stick it in between the strings so you can pull the strings out. It's a lot easier than using your fingers and a safety pin is too sharp. It'll go through the thing, go through the threads. Um, so that I really like that. I highly recommend it. It's a good investment uh, even if you're semi-serious. It's not like buying like a $300 cricket machine or anything but I love it. Um, can you do shout outs? Yeah if you join my Patreon you can get shout outs in my videos so go do that. You can also do cool, get cool things and do cool things like early access to my videos. You can you know, like, when you, like, when someone publishes a video and you're like, first, but, like, five other people comment first at the same time? If you become a Patreon, you can actually be the first person because you'll get the video 24 hours in advance. So, that's motivation. Plus, you'll get bracelets in the mail from me and a fun thank you card from me with lots of stickers and fun things. Um, <laughs> me using embroidery needles. She has already advanced beyond my own mind. Yeah, I went out and bought embroidery needles, like, for embroidery because I couldn't find my other embroidery needles. And today, 
my Wi-Fi was out, so I downloaded some um, some movies on my phone while they were fixing the Wi-Fi, like beforehand, because I knew they were going to fix it. And I have my old business card, so I cut it into a phone stand, which works very well because it can hold a phone. I was watching Les Miserables, if that's how you pronounce it. The movie is very good. It has Hugh Jackman, Russell Crowe, and Anne Hathaway like this. And on top of my old business card case was this second set of needles. So I have now like 50, no, like 20 needles, 25 needles that I'm not going to use. I only use one needle. I only needed one needle. And I have now like 25 of them. So I, I don't know. It's, I mean, this is size is three to nine and this is size five, but they all look the same to me. They're all the same length. They're all the same width. <laughs> they all look the same. So I guess yay for finding stuff and boo for finding it at the wrong time. I'm not sure. Um, thank you so much for accepting my friend request. Yeah, I have a lot of friend requests. I'm trying to get through them. Are you studying in New York itself for college? Yeah, I'll be hanging out in my house for the next uh, six months. <laughs> yeah, and hopefully I'll go to Baltimore in the spring, although I don't know if I'll open up or not. I know 50, like 20 people. Yes, for a STEM major, I'm very bad at counting doing things. I can do calculus, but in terms of elementary counting skills, I can't do that. What's the hour-long video about? It's a comprehensive guide on starting and ending your bracelet. Um, okay, this is, it says it's a cheer, cheerleading logo, senior elite. I don't know how, oh, ooh, that's a bracelet book. I don't know how many people would actually make this. Um, so I'll say that. I'm not sure how many people would actually make this, but it's a really nice pattern. Yeah. Can you do more bracelet tutorials? Yep, I am putting together a couple that I hope to film tutorials on soon. I finished numbering the pages. Yay! Hey! Hello. Let's see if the photos want to cooperate. Hey, you wanna you wanna cooperate? It's a no for me. Dude, I got so excited last week because my great grandma gave her gave me her entire embroidery collection thread, which is six tackle boxes of DMC. Wow. All my friends are dead. That's oh I I mean the edges aren't even but it's a very cute pattern. This is oh, that's so sad though. Yeah. All right. Um, do you, how do you do backward knots and forward knots with the same hand? I'm a righty, so I've kind of just evolved everything to do everything with my right hand because there's no way in heck um, that I can do stuff with my left hand. <laughs> All my friends are dead. <laughs> Dude, I love that bracelet. Yeah, it's a big, it's a big boy though. Um, all right. Yeah, this is a. I'll give you a three for that. And yeah, off to the chopper. I'm doing science homework and I hate it. As someone who wants to empathize with you, I'm sorry, but as someone who likes home uh, science, I don't really like homework, but I really like science. So how dare you? The dino. I have a pin with the same thing. Uh, yeah, I might. I don't know if I should make that. I don't know if I have that much green in like in one color green. How many bracelets should I have in stock before opening up my Etsy? Um, it's less of quantity and more of quality. If you have 20 bracelets, but they all have really bad lighting photos and indescriptive descriptions, <laughs> then it doesn't really matter how many or how few you have. Um, but if you have two like really good ones, then that's, that's sort of the best to do. That bracelet is based off a book. There you go. His are all dead. I don't even have any. Oh, sorry. Um, okay, so this one, the book is cute. Creaky, creaky. Oh, your lucky charm. Okay. Um. Okay, so that's cute. Uh, but the blue is a little dark. The blue is a little dark in the pattern preview. Could you either lighten it or separate it into? Two colors in order or to keep the body 
or is it a he or is it a she or is it a they? I don't know. I don't even know what it is. It looks like a bug, but it could be like it like the bottom part looks like like Stitch from like Lilo and Stitch. I'm not even sure. The body contrasted against the background. You could also make the background a little lighter instead. Yay! Okay. <laughs> because a lighter green, then everything would show up better. Yeah. It's the cricket from Mulan. Okay, it's a cricket. I didn't really watch Mulan. My bad. Sorry. Um, <laughs> I was literally scrolling through Instagram stories and saw that you were live and I banged open my laptop and I actually was watching one of your videos last night and it was on your profile. When worlds collide. Thank you. Um, this is cool. I love Nat Bunny. Their um, patterns are so amazing. Always. They have these like, here, I want to I wanna show you. I don't, I don't even, I don't know them at all. I, I, I just love their patterns because I see them all the time when I'm moderating. Like, they, these are thick boys. Like, look at that. Okay, they're, it's taking forever to load. I'm so sorry. Um, do you have any tips on how to continue knotting a pattern that you don't like? I'd recommend not doing a pattern that you don't like in the first place because then you just never will want to do it. But anyway, see? Look at those, those fat boy patterns. Those are some damn boy he thick. Um, are you Ravenclaw? Yes, I am. Try pictures again. I, I feel like it's going to be worse. I mean, it's not even loading right now. Um, how much longer will you be streaming for? I'm not sure, but if you do come back and I'm not here, then uh, it will be available on my YouTube for you to watch whenever you want. All right. This has already been submitted and like resubmitted. I don't know, <laughs> but yeah. Um, do you like Jumanji and who do you like in the movie? Is that the one where they go into the video game with Dwayne The Rock Johnson? Or is that Django? I think it's Jumanji. I'm not sure. I don't really remember. I watched it a while ago. I like the girl. I don't like how she's over-sexualized even though I know that's the point of the video game. I don't- I don't know. I didn't vibe with that movie. If I'm thinking of the one that's the video game with Dwayne The Rock Johnson. I go to an art school so it's cool to hear someone who cares about academics. Yeah, I really do care. Um... I don't agree with this one. I don't know if oh, it's olive oil. Uh, I'm gonna ask them to rotate it because I think it is nice and it is like an avatar thing. Oh my god, it's the bisexual worm, and it's it's the bisexual worm, but it's pan. <laughs> um, can you do a live where you embroider and we embroider? I think that would be fun and I would embroider with you. <laughs> that would be fun, but I don't know how to set up like an external webcam and I have to figure that out because this I am already don't know how to like I don't know when the software starts my live and I don't know when it ends my live. So sometimes there's just like this awkward pause in like the first 15 seconds where I'm just like Hello everyone, welcome. And then at the end I'll just be like, bye, and I'll just shut off. So I don't know. Okay, this is a three, so I'm just gonna remove that. Oh, sorry, love. Um, how can you rotate patterns in the Alpha Maker? Okay, life hack, you can't do it, but if you have a Mac, you can do Command Shift 4. That's Command Shift 4. If you're not on a Mac, you can just take a screenshot in however you do it and try to take a screenshot so you basically like enclose the pattern, like don't get any white space. Then count the pixels or look at the pixels. Uh, first, okay, first of all, rotate it. So here, I'll do it right now. Um, here, let's go to brace the book. So, these are all of my patterns right here. Um, I submitted this like a year ago. Like this was way before. Um, there were meant to be double X and double uh, double X and X Y chromosomes. Um, so someone asked to rotate the pattern. So what I want to do is I will do a screenshot. So I just hit Command Shift Four, then I can click and drag. There we go. So I'm getting the pattern exactly just like that. So that just took a pattern. It just took a screenshot. And so I'm clicking on it and I can rotate it. Rotate. And so it rotates like that. I can hit done. And then I can see the dimensions are 21 by 58. So then I can go alpha from image. And I also noticed I have five colors back here because it says alpha five colors, one, two, three, four, five. So I'll do alpha from image. We have five colors, 21 by 51, 21 by 51. And colors, we have five. 
and then we'll go to choose file and then I know screenshots screenshots that's not how you spell screenshots heck screen screen <laughs> I don't know how to do this screenshot I'm trying to do this as fast as I can without you guys all seeing my personal files and then we'll save and test and we'll run it through the generator and it looks a little funky right now but if we go back through so I'll go draw alpha and then I can actually change the colors so this color I can see this background color I can try and make it um, okay so the background color is white so I want this to be white like that and I'm just gonna do this one at a time I guess this is not really moderating anymore it's more just designing a pattern um, so then I'll go back to draw alpha and everywhere that I want it to be white I'll hit fill and then I'll just fill all that with white so I can make the background white yeah make it white please don't take that out of context I do believe in equality for all races um, so there we go so everything is all nice and white now and I can make this background white background white because it just became dark gray for no reason um, yeah I also haven't looked at this pattern in like a year so I, I don't really know what's going on <laughs> and I'm sure there are better ways to do this like in a pixel pattern generator or something but this is just the way I do it I don't I'm too lazy to research other forms of pixel lighting things um yeah so anyway um this is meant to be xx and i looked at an image for this for reference so it's meant to be like that there's one here one here um that's not supposed to be there sorry i'm not responding to any of the comments i just want to get this done um okay and then we're gonna go for a little more of a precision can i zoom in zoom out zoom out no i can't okay uh so I'll just go like that and sort of tweak it. Tweak it, tweak it, tweak it, tweak it, streaky, streaky. <laughs> Hello. Um, yeah. And then we can look for here. So we have to save because I've made this many times. Uh, where I will not save. <laughs> what bracelets do you send to your patrons? I send uh bracelets that are on the thicker side. Um not super thick but not super thin either but if they're thin i'll send two but i try to show them lots of love because i'm always super appreciative of uh, everything that they do so yay yay why is it so hard to create a normal pattern on bracelet book i don't know i'm sorry <laughs> okay this is meant to be blackish so i'm gonna put it over there yay Yay. Wow, that's super dark. Okay, um, I didn't mean to do that. I actually don't, heck, want it like that. I don't want it that dark. Um, my computer is making a lot of noise right now. Yeah, Masha's working on it. Don't worry. <laughs> Masha's got you. Um, okay, this is looking a little red, which I don't like. This one's based in the purple, so I'm gonna, I have no idea what I'm saying. I'm so sorry. Uh, I'm doing my best, guys. Okay. Um. Yeah. I don't know if it's. I mean, this is kind of haphazard. I don't even know, know if this is going to get, I don't even know if I'm going to submit it or not, but you guys get the idea. Just like tweak it and stuff. I'll, I'll do the rest of it later. Um, yeah, after your stream, I have to start my AP Psychology summer homework. Yeah, they gave us so much summer homework in high school saying you're going to have more in college. Joke's on you. I have no summer homework and I'm going to the top university, uh, research university in the world and I have no, no summer homework. So, ha <laughs> roasted. Just, just show them this live saying and just say like, Alex said I don't have to do my homework. And they're going to have to listen because, no, they don't have to. <laughs> I have no authority over them. Um, 
Yeah. What are some good pattern suggestions? I really like pattern 28009. I've uh, said this earlier, but I really like it because um, it's mine and it's really fast. It takes me about an hour to make it. And uh, I also have a tutorial for it. How long will the stream be? Uh, probably not much longer because I'm really hungry. <laughs> but um, the stream will be available on YouTube so you can watch it whenever you want, wherever you want. Verizon, your home network. Oh, I just accepted that. Well, it's okay. The, the colors are okay. Uh, have you watched The Office? Yes, I did. That was like the first major TV show I got into because I wasn't allowed to watch TV as a kid. And so we got Netflix in like ninth grade, when I was in ninth grade. And I watched like all of it and it took me like, like three months, which wasn't that bad because I wasn't used to the idea of binge watching stuff yet. Um, but yeah. <laughs> Ooh, someone's being rude. What's the tea? Okay, Simran Panda. Okay, no need to be rude. Hmm, what's going on here? I don't, I can't, oh, no. I can't find it. I can't, I can't find them. Okay, they might have redacted their comment. Ooh, roast it. <laughs> okay. Um, my little sister keeps asking me to do, do photos. I'm, I'm sorry, um, the, my computer isn't loading the photos. Um, oh, look at that, they're loading photos now. Okay, I guess you're in luck now. <laughs> I love that Alex said she's gonna end because she's hungry. Yeah, I ate breakfast at like 11 a.m. and it's now 5, so it's been like 6 hours and I'm feeling a little hungry right now. <laughs> sorry, I'm a, f I'm a human. Ooh. Um... I'm not sure about this. Hold on, hold the phone. I'm not sure if uh, if uh, user IDs are allowed to be in there. Photos. Um, text contained the pattern ID. Okay, so yeah, that's allowed. Nice. Yay, pictures now. I just said I was losing some of my best friends. Oh no, I'm sorry. I can't find the other person's comment. Maybe they left. Sorry, can't can't defend you. <laughs> Um, Netflix recommendations. What sort of vibes are you looking for? Because I have different recommendations based on the vibes. Um, if you wanted to send, if I wanted to send you a birthday thing, can I use your Etsy shipping address? Yes, you can. I ship from my house because I do not have an office. I, I don't make that much and I wouldn't want to leave the house every day because that would mean that I'd have to like make bracelets in an office, which would just not be fun because I'd want to uh, make bracelets here. Okay, this looks like it's the same bracelet because the same colors, so I'm just gonna say only one photo of the same bracelet is allowed to be updated. How do I grow my Etsy shop without, like, money? I have one that's super small and I don't really know how to advertise it or to get people to go to it. Well, you were saying how to, uh, how to grow your Etsy shop without money. Do you, I, I would like you to know that running an Etsy does take money. Like, you can't make an Etsy for free because listings are 20 cents and then they take out a 5% fee plus like a 4% like payment processing fee, something like that. Um, but in terms of advertising, you can use an Instagram. Um, I really like that. You can also use TikTok. TikTok is a great platform for, um, because it just has, oh heck, it just has so much potential for you to like get viral, to grow, get, go viral. <laughs> That's the word. His way, my way, or his way. Accepting $5 foot lungs if you buy two or more. <laughs> I have to go and eat now. Thanks for doing lives and being great. Oh, thank you so much for, for coming. Thanks, thanks for coming. Okay. Um. Ooh. Ooh. Very nice. We love to see all these photos. You've been live streaming for a while. Yeah, I have. I'm sorry. Do you have tips before I open a shop? Should I make tons of patterns different? But should I? I don't really know what you're asking. But I don't think you should make a lot of different listings. I think you should focus on a few and put all your energy into those few. And then once you're done with those and you sell those, then you can work on sort of branching out. But it doesn't do you any good to have 20 listings, but they're all super bad. Like you want to have good lighting. You should not use exclamation points in your listings. Um. Oh, I was wondering if um you guys wanted me to like review your Etsy shops. This is not me spending money because I already did that and I'm not going to go and spend a hundred another hundred dollars because I want to support your Etsy shops. But I'd rather do that in giving constructive feedback that doesn't result in me losing a lot of money over it. If you can understand that. I'm sorry, I don't want to be mean, but I also can't afford to buy 
<laughs> bracelets, <laughs> more bracelets, but would it be cool if I, like, went onto your Etsy website and, like, told you, like, what you could do? And, like, I'm gonna try and be nice about it, but I'm also gonna try and give you constructive feedback. So, like, it would be cool if, like, like, if you have, like, photos. Like, let's just say this photo was uploaded to an Etsy. So, like, completely, oh, com like, completely different standards. I'm not gonna do anything on moderating, but let's just use this as a photo. And they were selling this keychain. Not even looking at the product, like the product itself, I'd be looking at the photo. So first I'd say this is a very patterned background and it sort of detracts from the photo. Um, also we have, it's a very shadowy over here where it's a little bit washed out over here. So I'd recommend tilting the, tilting the, the keychain so it's the same, um, like evenness overall so you can see all the knots. I'd recommend using a light background so if there are holes you can't really see them. I recommend don't use Photoshop because then you're selling a false product and that would be terrible. And of course, crop your photos because you don't want that. But in terms of like for a bracelet book, this is great. So I'm accepting it. Um, but like if, okay, so it sounds like people would like that. So when I go, I'll probably, I'm trying. Yeah, I'll film it. I have a ring light now because I I um, I, I, I purchased a ring light from, from my Patreon funds, which is like super nice. Yeah, uh, I'm going to put a sticker in my Etsy if... Uh, if you want me to review your Etsy shops, and this means your website not buying stuff, but just like tips and tricks. But I also am going to film an Etsy tips and tricks video, so it will be like the one after that. I was also thinking of doing like sort of like a, like a, Vsauce has these things called leanbacks. Vsauce is a very nice YouTuber that I really like. I wrote him a letter like two months ago and he never responded. But then again, he has like 15 million subscribers, so I don't expect him to. It's okay. Um, wow, imagine a YouTuber who responded to their messages. Couldn't be me. Oh wait, it is me. Haha. <laughs> but I don't have 15 million subscribers. But anyway, um, he does this thing called a lean back. So basically he creates a playlist. And so he puts together some videos he really likes. And then like after each one, he just sort of says like, yeah, like this next video, I like it because it does this. And it also does this. And that's why I like it. And so I was thinking of doing something similar, but like need to make, like, have you never made bracelets before? Start here. And then the intro will be like, hello. So you've decided you want to make a bracelet now, have you? First, I recommend checking out my basic knots video, and then it will like cue the basic knots video. It will play, and then it will be like, "Welcome back! Now to practice your skills, um, work on the two knot bracelet. It's the next video, and it only uses two knots, hence two knot bracelet." And like, and then it would go to that, and I'd be like, "Welcome back! Now you can practice your skills and make a little thicker bracelet with a candy stripe." Like, I don't know if that would be cool. Um, I mean, I guess you guys are watching, I don't know how many of you guys actually make friendship bracelets, and like how many of you guys just like chilling for my, my awkward and incessant rambling of my lives, just, just to feel, feel not alone. I don't know, when I, when I stream, I don't feel alone, uh, as alone, I mean, I mean, I, I'm not like seeing anyone in like in person ever, so it's a little sad. I do see some people, but I try to be safe, and being safe and going outside. Be nice. Do I believe in flat earth? No, I believe in science. Ooh, dovetail. Ooh, it's so neon-y. I love it. Okay. Um, hola! How are you today, Alex? I'm good. I don't know, live streaming always cheers me up. Not that I was sad before, but just wanted some- wanted to vibe with you guys. I'm thinking of starting an Etsy shop. I'm not really sure what to sell. Um, you're into a lot of things, and you're 13. Wow. Well, first tip is to put in your, either commit tax fraud, which is what I'm going to be doing for the next 12 days until I turn 18 and can actually put in my social security number and not have the IRS coming after me because I'm under 18 and running an Etsy shop illegally. Ooh, don't tell anyone. I, if anyone snitches, I'm going to come for your britches, <laughs> which are a type of pants in Britain. I did not curse, I promise. How many pictures are there? It looks to be 47 photos. I'm going through them, I promise. Also, it's possible that other moderators are moderating at the same time, so it's possible I might not get to your photo. I I can't I can't guarantee that. I'm sorry. Um, I feel like this person just submitted a photo for this one. Unless it was like a very similar photo. Um, Glitch Pup and Disney Chum. Okay, so it's different, but still good. I'm calling the IRS on you right now. No! Do you remember me? Where do I, where am I remembering you from? I'm sorry. <laughs> yes, I do make bracelets. Cool, cool. I'm calling the IRS. Right now, I'm currently making a bracelet. Um, I am currently making a bracelet. 
Yes, that's right, because um, that's what I do here. But I'm making a bracelet. Um, the person who gave me all the string in like that big priority mailbox I showed earlier, they gave me some foiled like metallic thread. So I'm making some of these. I don't even know if you can see them, um, but that's what they look like. I don't know. They're like a bordered chevron. So basically, inside of the chevron is a chevron, and then the outside of the chevron is a border. Wow. Amazing. And I'm working on a third one so I can list them all in one Etsy shop, save myself 40 cents by um, combining all of them into one listing, uh, and then getting that, that dank college revenue fund. Oh wow. Girls who can pay for college. It couldn't be me. I'm working, I'm working on it. I'm, I'm working really hard on it. I promise I am. How did you even open an Etsy without a social security? Um, I'm not sure. I, I, I opened it as a hobby, not a, not as a business. Although right now it's because you shouldn't have to pay taxes unless you're making a certain amount every year. And I'm not making that amount, but Etsy emailed me saying like, hee hoo, we think you might hit that amount sometime. Hee hoo, wanna hee hoo, put in your social security number, hee hoo, so you don't commit tax evasion, hee hoo. And so now I just have this big glaring warning just saying like, hee hoo. You might be committing tax evasion. Um, I'll, I'll show you. It's not that bad because it's still letting me like sell stuff. It's just every time I open my Etsy, it's just like, it just shakes me. It's just, it's like it gets spooky. You've been live streaming for an hour and a half. I know. Yeah. See, so it says invalid taxpayer information. Ooh, invalid taxpayer information. So it's either missing or doesn't match IRS records. I don't know if it is missing or if it doesn't match, and I don't want to update it because, of course, that's my personal information on the internet. But um, it's possible that it is incorrect, and it's just my dad's because I might have used my dad's, who is over 18. Um, but uh, that's definitely what I did for PayPal because my PayPal name is my dad's name because I just said, hey, PayPal, you know what? You want to keep this between us? My name my name is now my dad's name, all right? We don't, we, we don't have to talk about it. And then when someone sends me money, like personally, I don't, I don't do PayPal um, bracelet orders, but when someone sends me money personally, they're like, is your name your dad's name? And I'm just like, just like, just pretend it is. Just, just pretend. I'm in my first pair of weird earrings. Let me tell you, I feel unstoppable. Yes, the, the confidence, the pride, the, the hidden message, the bat signal. It's, it's Gadar and it is amazing. Um, ooh, okay. Yes, it is unlimited power. You just accepted my photo with the dawn. Yay! <laughs> oh dear. Um, any tips on starting a YouTube channel about bracelets? Try to make a tutorial that no one else has made before because if you just make one on a bracelet like the candy stripe, there are tons of tutorials. Um, so try and make it on something that's unique but you think something would be someone would be interested in. Oh, look at that. They're evil eye brace, um, earrings. That's so, weird. That's so cool. But yeah, try and uh, make something that no one else has made before. Be different. Be quirky. Because then there will be, like, people will want that. If there's something else, people aren't going to make it. That's so adorable. Oh, my God. Um, okay. I'll grab that. Um... Can you make a video on how to start with an Etsy? Yep, yeah, it's already planned. I'll probably film it right after I'm done with this one, um, just to get it out of the way because I feel in my in my like video groove right now. Okay, it says August 2020 challenge. It says official. Let me just check on those uh, those pictures submitted. Just making sure, making sure if they're official. I don't know if they're official or not, and I don't want to check, but I might have to check. I don't want to deny them of reward. But they said it was official. I don't know if it's official. It might have to be official. Okay, I'm just going to give them a reward because I don't want to deny them a reward. Heck, JJMKO. Okay, this is my first time actually catching one of your lives. Wow, when worlds collide. Do you like it here? I hope you like it here. If not, I just wasted an hour and a half of your time. But if you do, then yay. Do you know the user that sc sends scary email messages in Bracelet Book? I don't know them, but we've I've received like like five requests personally, and all the other moderators have also received requests to take them down. So, as Alex says, be quirky and people might notice you, but not too quirky. I don't like that much attention. Hey, if you get so much attention, then uh, then you might be called out as a Walmart version, which is really cool because you have cool prices, you have great hours, and great products, and you sell DMC thread for less than normal. 
And on that note, I'm going to shut it down for now. Thank you so much for coming. It's been over an hour and a half. I'm hungry. I want to film a video. You guys have lives to get back to. And my dad's certainly home, and he's heard me rambling for the last half hour at least. So, um, love Alex singing. Was I singing? I don't know. Might have just forgotten that the last hour and a half existed. But I don't think I talked about any of my past trauma, so I think that's a milestone for today. Um, anyway, yeah. Thank you so much for watching. Um, see you next time. Uh, go hop on my channel and watch some of my other lives if you still want to keep keep the lives coming. Uh, like, comment, and subscribe. <laughs> okay, bye guys!